Hi everyone. Today's fitness video, we're going to be doing a Tabata workout. So that's going to be 20 second intervals of exercise followed by 10 seconds of rest. We're going to repeat two exercises for each song going back and forth in between the two um, and then have a minute of rest in between each song. Remember to keep water handy um, and a towel if you sweat a lot. Enjoy! We're starting with our warm up. So just a step touch. exercises. It's going to be jumping jacks for 20 seconds, followed by a 10 second rest, and then push-ups for 20. 10 second rest. Three, two, Here we go. One. Remember you can do the regular 
regular push-ups or the ones on your knees. I'm wearing socks, so I'm going to take them off. If you are in socks, the next few tracks may be difficult for you. Um, you might be sliding a little bit, so just be careful of that. If you need to get sneakers on or take your socks off, do so now. You have about another 30 seconds. <laughs>
surprise me and start counting down. So in this track, you're going to be doing skaters. That's your cardio exercise. Doesn't matter which foot you start on, you're going to leap to one side with the foot that's on that side. The other foot's going to come behind. So it's jump behind. I like to keep this leg in the back up. That gives you more of a workout. Again, um, like a lower impact, if the jumping bothers you, step, cross, step, cross. The next exercise after that is going to be a plank. So 20 second plank at a time. It's totally okay if you can't do the whole 20 seconds. Think about how much you're doing in this one workout. I might have to go down a few times as well. Just keep coming back up. Make sure you breathe through it and just do the best you can. You're only in competition with yourself, okay? No one else but yourself.
right, so for this one, okay, so I don't have to rush my talking. For this one, we're going to try standing abs for the first exercise. So you're going to see, I'm either going to say knees to the front or knees to the side. Now this works your oblique muscles, so you're just going to come out to the side. So we're going to do a combination of both of those. And then your second exercise is going to be reverse lunges. So instead of stepping forward, you're just going to be stepping backward. All right, here we go. We're going to start with the front knee. Pick up the feet a little. are 
relaxing, slowing your heart rate down, getting some water, I'm gonna show you what we're doing for our last exercise track. Again, it's going to be 20 second intervals followed by 10 seconds of rest. Um, it's all on the floor, so we're going to do the ab portion of our workout. So coming down, you're going to start with crunches. I just wanted to go over um, a few things because it doesn't really matter where you put your hands as long as you're comfortable. But I do want to point out that if you're putting them on your neck, that you're not pulling your neck. So when you're down here, you want to take your stomach and push it down to the ground. You're either going to put your arms across your chest. You can put them at your side if you want. If you go with behind your neck, do not pull on your neck. Make sure you're lifting from your stomach. Now, it doesn't matter if you come up this much or if you really come up. Just do what, what you can. So this is all about your level. You might not be able to come up that far, and that's okay because next time you'll come up further. Make sure to breathe. Oh, and then a second exercise. So crunches is going to be first. Then we have bicycle crunches. So what that is, your legs are, it's like you're pedaling. Now, whatever knee is forward, the opposite elbow is going to come towards that knee. Again, if you can't do all 20 seconds, that's fine. Relax, and then just keep trying to do more. So if you need to rest for a second and then come back and join us, totally fine. Here we go. Thank <laughs> you. 
One more set of each. Go to the best you can. So this kind of goes along with the flexibility we've been working on, um, but it's also good to stretch out your legs in several different ways, especially after all the squats and lunges and everything that we've been doing. So I'm going to put on the music. Sit up nice and tall. Reach your toes. Back, come to one foot. 
and song. Now we're going to start with the upper part of our body, then we have a little bit more leg stretching to go. So take one arm, put it over to the other side, gently pull. Broken down and tired. I'll believe in life on a merry go round. Take that elbow you can put it behind your head. But I see you, so we gon' walk it out. Mountain. Both arms up, roll those wrists. We gon' walk it out. Other arm over. Good job, everyone.